Good evening, everybody, and I am. we are in 365 gifts, and I'm going to start with yesterday's, which was number 135, and it's entitled Ideas. For we are his workmanship, created in Christ Jesus, for good works, which God prepared beforehand, that we should walk in them. Ephesians 2, verse 10. You're stuck with one just as you're falling asleep. If you don't write it down, you might forget. I I uh, I read years ago. Keep a notepad by by the bed with a with a pen, which I've been using my. I've actually I've got that plus I I use my notes on my phone. Um, but if there's something that you can't get, just write it down and then you can go to sleep. It's amazing. Or if you wake up and you have a thought, write it down and then go back to sleep. It just takes your all the worries and you don't forget. It, you don't worry about it. You just let it go. If you don't write it down, you might forget. Another one hits when you're in the shower. No way to scribble something down in here. Pass the bath crayons, please. <laughs> so you'll have to do your best not to forget. Your best one yet comes as you're driving the kids to school. Ideas come at the strangest time, don't they? Theory has it they strike when you're the most relaxed. Maybe it's time to keep a pen and paper on your bedside table. <laughs> Great minds. If you're a creative, bright brain thinker, you might be loaded with ideas. You have far too many to act on. Ask God to show you which ones are meant to stick. If ideas don't come easily to you, ask the Lord to stir your creative juices and for a spirit to hover over you, as it did during creation. He will do it. You are created in the image of your very creative father, after all. I'm so glad I have your creative DNA, Father. Sometimes I feel like ideas are flowing by the minute. Not every amazing idea will come to fruition, but I thank you for the possibility to dream, to imagine, to wonder. How I love seeing the finest ones come to pass. Amen. I hope you enjoyed that. Stay tuned. We have more coming up. Love to all bunches. Bye.